Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is DCSG81. Today we will look into this new Marvel Legends for Captain Marvel. Um, I believe this is a newly released in the market. And uh, as you can see, this is the uh, uh, Walmart exclusive that uh, is for the Captain Marvel binary forms. So. Let's take a look at the packaging. Okay, the packaging is the uh, standard uh, Marvel Legends packaging where you can see there are some pictures of uh, Brie Larson's as uh, the Captain Marvel. The same over here. And uh, there's some, uh, some things for you to read. If you like to read it, you can pause the video now. So, okay. The standard um, packaging, where you can see everything here. So, let's proceed to unbox. Okay, this is the figure right out of the box. So let's take a closer look. So as you can see, the hair is translucent. It's very well made. If you shine the lights through, you can see that it really looks like it's um, glowing. And the eyes, I think they painted the eyes. Yeah, it is painted, but it looks as though it's glowing as well. It's very well done. And I like the hand whereby it's fully translucent. You can see the, uh, the joint inside. It's fully transparent. It's very well made. And the rest of the body, I think it's just the similar, uh, it's just similar to the one that uh, has been released uh, previously. So, uh, painting is a little glossy it's very well made here there's no um, paints that are uh, actually um, painted over or any paint chip or any smudges there's nothing like that so I can say that it's, it's being painted very well I really love the hair someone actually mentioned that it would be great if the hair is fully uh, flowing out like um, in the trailer so I agree that it that will look uh, perfect but uh, I believe they just uh, reuse the head from the previous release of uh, Carol Denver the one that is wearing the jacket so they just use back the same mold and then they just make the hair translucent so uh, I'm not surprised that they reuse the mold. So, um, but it, it still looks very great because there's a flowing part here. Unlike the uh, the the one that is uh, the normal one which I have here. And also one thing I noticed that the skin is uh, slightly more uh, pinkish, like uh, as you can see the. It's a little different, a little uh, more pale because I think it's to match the hair because uh, when it's glowing, you can't be having the same skin tone. It will be light reflecting off your skin so you will look slightly more pale like now. So it's great that they actually uh, take note of this. So I think it looks beautiful. And this look very much like her as well. So this 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 here is not provided. This is from the other Walmart exclusive which I bought, which is the uh, Star Force version, which I will show you later. Okay, let's go through the articulation. The head can turn. You can uh, look down like this much. 
look up in this much and the arms there's a little hinder here but this piece here is soft so it, it, it allows you still go to 90 degrees you can turn 360 okay the arms can turn this side not a problem this is the furthest that it can go okay. there's a joint on the torso you can or oh, you can turn down a little not much slightly better in turning up there's no gap that is shown which is great okay there's a tight swivel here the leg can go this far can go up this much and then almost fully which is great and there's a there's a joint here and, but there's no toe hinge okay next we'll take a look at all the accessories given so we have an alternative head which uh, with the glowing eyes as well as the glowing hair which is uh, again is done beautifully as you can see is uh, translucent and one thing I noticed is that this is not the same mold as the one that is given all this while because if you notice the previous one is smiling at the side same goes with the normal version which I don't have but I have uh, taken a look uh, at the picture it's exactly the same as this Star Force one which is uh, slightly smiling but this one is on a very serious look which I like it a lot because when you he's, when she's in this form she can't be smiling right she's getting very angry or very serious and ready to fight so this is a very good move uh, by Marvel Legend they actually uh, changed the face I mean the mouth to be more serious although there's, there isn't much change but at least they uh, take this into consideration and make her to look more serious okay so other than this they have given uh, two effects like a, a fireball to attach to her hand her fist so that it's like when she's punching then it it feels like a, a fireball and it's very well made it's a soft rubbery let's try to put it on So it's something like this it's like a fireball which is very cool okay and the next is the some sort of like a flame effects uh, that is supposed to be over the hands It's like when she's charging her her power. This looks very very well done. Okay. Oh, I have not tried changing the head.
somehow I feel that the uh, the joint seems like it doesn't go in fully. That makes it a bit the neck is slightly longer than usual. Let's compare with this one. Yeah, as you can see, this is the neck is like the head can go slightly into it. doesn't go any further in but it's still looking very good but I prefer the uh, the normal head yeah, this one will will make the neck look slightly better more natural compared to that so it's a bummer next we should proceed with the uh, size comparison so first of all I'll compare her with the uh, Marble Legend um, Star Force then we have the um, SHF um, Captain America okay. and next we have the uh, SHF uh, Black Widow, which is slightly shorter than her. Next, we have um, the Figma Deadpool. And next, we have the uh, Mayfax Homecoming Spider Man. Which is uh, again shorter than her. Next, we have the uh, Masco Ragnarok Tall. We should be bigger than her, as you can see. And next, we have the uh, SHF uh, Infinity War Hawk. Which tower over her, of course. And lastly, we will have the uh, SHF Thanos. So these are the size comparison. As you can see, it's um, I think it scaled pretty well can match with your SH figures of course um, next month we'll be releasing the uh, SH figures for Captain Marvel which I have pre-ordered so uh, I'm getting that for sure so we'll have the variation of uh, 3 Captain Marvel or maybe I'll just change this to the Star Force because they actually give an additional hit to become a Star Force soldier, which I think is pretty cool. So I will actually uh, change that to the soldier and this is the full power mode and the SH figures one will be the the normal Captain Marvel version. Okay, the next one will be the pros and cons. Um, um, I feel that this is a very well made figure from uh, Marvel Legend. It, I'm very happy about it and um, it's been uh, really well made and uh, so the pros will be I think it looks very much like the actress Brie Larson. So this is uh, the likeness is there. The paint job is pretty detailed and uh, well done. And uh, the gloss, I, I just like the glossiness. It just make it looks like um, it doesn't look like a Marvel Legend figure. It looks like a SH figures, uh, figures. So this is a great job. And uh, the translucent part is very nicely done. Okay, so 
so this is the pros and um, articulation wise I believe um, we can't expect much because it's still a Marvel Legend so you can't be expecting uh, SHV Guard's articulation on the Marvel Legend so there's still some limitation here and there but I believe it's, uh, it's sufficient to do uh, all the poses that you want uh, because um, she's not a Spider-Man Spider-Man you require a more dynamic uh, poses but I think she should be fine with Marvel Legends so um, okay the accessory wise I think is pretty good they give uh, these two effects plus the fireball effects and the interchangeable head so I think it suffice but uh, I'm just hoping for another uh, relaxed hand for to change so in this one they just give the, the, the fist hand which makes sense because when she's in this mode I believe she's fighting so there's no point giving a relaxed hand but I still hope for a relaxed hand that um, maybe when she's I don't know they just just uh, a, a, pair, a, a pair more of hands should uh, increase the playability of the figure so these are my pros and for cons I can't really see much except for the head just now where I mentioned it doesn't really go inside which is uh, this head maybe let's just try again the hole is pretty deep so it should go in pretty well yeah, I think maybe it's just mine that has this problem. Let me know if yours is having the same problem. But from certain angle, it might not look that bad, especially if she's on the flying mode. Yeah, can't really tell. But if you just look like this, you can tell that the neck is long. So this is my only cons, and as well as uh they should give uh, another relaxed hand for interchange but they doesn't so i think overall is still a, a good figure so my final verdict for her is will be uh, 9 out of 10 because i really like this figure it's, um, it's good that marvel legend actually uh do something like this although it's still a variation but i think this is a very good variation that you know they actually give uh something like this and the hair is very well done it's not just a repaint and you know and then make it a walmart exclusive i think this is a well deserved uh walmart exclusive so yep if you looking for it i think i mean if you saw it you think you should get it she's so beautiful very well made okay, so it's it's a 9 out of 10 it's good so that's the end of my review i hope you enjoy it and if you like my video please press the like button and uh, if you dislike it um, let me know and uh, feel free to comment on my video below I'll try to answer uh, your questions and um, yeah if you like my video so far uh, I hope you will subscribe to my channel because I'll be making new video uh, almost every day and uh, to reveal figures or to do some other fun stuff okay and uh, I would like to say thank you to all of you who have subscribed to my channel Yep, and uh, it's, it's an honor to to see people are uh, following me because I'm still a newbie in uh, YouTube. I hope to improve and uh, and also to to share my passion in this collection uh, to with all of you. I hope you enjoy enjoy as much as I do. Okay. So thank you very much for your time and I speak to you soon. Good night.